Hey guys, welcome back to Industry Day at the Reigns at SHOT Show 2024. I'm Luke C. and I'm here with Cody from Diamondback Firearms. We're talking about a very first for Diamondback. What do we got here? We got our 357 stainless steel, got fiber optic sights. This is pretty exciting to us because we released the 22 a couple years ago. Right. And we learned a lot from that. And we really want to do this right, so we invested in a lot of new equipment, better tools, better machines. And so it's been a big step for us. But uh, you're going to have your swing out cylinder six rounds at 21 ounces and you could do your research and, and try to see how much 21 Absolutely ounces likely. is on a 357 it's cool and i don't know what you guys have done i mean this is obviously a j frame and yes, sir. we were just shooting it on the range there's really not of course we were shooting 38 special as a caveat but yes sir there's really not a lot of recoil for how light that thing that's is. that's right and the fact that it's kind of based off a of j frame any aftermarket grip will will fit it so pretty much any smith and wesson j yep. frame grips will, yep. will go right on there yes yeah, so if you want extended grips and you wanted to be able to handle that recoil a little better, throw it on there. Right, and uh, you guys mentioned it earlier, but uh, this actually ships with two different sets of uh, grips, right? Yes, these sir. Are, these are hose grips, right? Yes, sir. So you're going to have one for comfort, you're going to have one for looks, because you know how those gun people are. You yeah. Know, you want something pretty, but you also want something it, It's got to look good for Instagram and Facebook That's and all right. that stuff. Now, what's SDR stand for? So, I mean, it, it pretty much leaves the door open. It's uh, for, for a bunch of different models, but it's just a self-defense revolver. Self-defense revolver. Okay. So, hey, say maybe we come out with a target revolver one day. We have something to kind of branch off of. So, right. yeah, self-defense revolver. You're going to have a push-button cylinder release. Yeah, that's that's a really cool feature because, you know, otherwise, you know, a tool takedown is a lot of effort and revolvers get really dirty because they have a bunch of open and exposed parts. That's right. So that's a, that's a time saver right there. Ultrasonic cleaner, drop it in. Yeah. Now you don't have to worry about stuff getting in your trigger mechanism. Yeah. Um, now the sights are that these patterned after any specific sights. Like let's say I wanted to, I, let's say I don't like fiber optics. I love them, but or I want night sights. Is there a different set of sights I can put on there? So this it is a proprietary sight, but if somebody really wanted to get creative, it is a Glock dovetail cut in the back. Oh really? And you may if you're if you're good with tools, you may be able to carve something out and make it fit. Okay. But uh, yeah, it's, you, you're gonna have a transfer bar safety in this. You're gonna have a very smooth double action so yeah. you're gonna be at right about about nine pounds but it's gonna be smooth okay and then you're gonna have roughly about a two pound two single pound action so if you want action. something yeah and then it stages nice too so if you wanted to take that double action take your time and get a good shot you, you could do that with this and then uh we're here in vegas so we're like hey let's make msrp 777 so triple sevens yeah ching now um, that means there's a gold version coming too that drops out of the slot machine. That's in, right. In the yeah, right. You never know. <laughs> but uh, no, it's been a huge step for us. It's been a. Uh, it's going to make our future a lot better because of the tools that we had to invest in. So you're talking about future. That implies that there's going to be other revolvers coming down the line. Hey. Um, and you guys started off with, I think, a really handsome looking, uh, high polished stainless steel here. Yes, sir. Is there possibility for like maybe a matte black or something a little bit more discreet down the road? Absolutely. All it takes is people asking for it. Yeah. So if people are asking for it, we're going to give it to you. Tell Diamondback what kind of SDR you want yeah, and they'll make us. it for you. Yep. It's Burger Bruh. King, but for revolvers. Yes. <laughs> hey, we're not going to do any pink on this one. Okay? Oh, no pink. Sorry, ladies. <laughs> All right, so new revolver, which means new holster usually. That's uh, right. So what are we talking about? I, do you have holsters ready for this, or, or is it compatible with ones I have already? So that's always the biggest issue. Everybody, you have to wait for a bunch of variety of holsters to come out. Yeah. So we try to keep it ready off the shelf, ready to go. So if you got your favorite J-Frame revolver uh, holster out there, just throw it in it. It goes right in? Fits right here. Oh, and this is made for yeah. This is made for a completely different revolver. So that's right. There you go. A holster so you're compatibility right out of the gate. Yeah. That's right. Cool. Well, thank you for showing us the new SDR. Um, before we go, when can I pick one of these up, and how much is it going to cost me? I know you mentioned. Yeah. Seven, so we're looking at Q2. Okay. Q2. We're going to get those out, but uh, yeah, MSRP is going to be 777. Okay. Cool. Well, thank you so much, guys. Thank you for stopping by here to check out TFP TV and TFP, TFP TV Showtime. Stay tuned for more from Shot Show 2024. That's right. Thank you. Awesome.